Motor Week, television's automotive magazine. Your host for Motor Week, John Davis. Well, hello and welcome again to Motor Week. We're glad to have you with us. To some people, the term family car only means midsize or larger sedans. But with today's car prices, many buyers are opting for smaller sedans to fill their family needs. We get a lot of requests to feature these miniature movers here on Motor Week. So many, in fact, that if we fulfilled them all, we'd never have time for anything else. So we decided to pull together the best examples of the small sedan class to help find the ones that are right for you. That's easier said than done, however. Today's small cars are the best ever. And these five front drivers are leaders in their class. At the head of our small car parade is the Dodge and Plymouth Neon. Only available since January, the Neon is already a hit, even picking up our Driver's Choice Award. The top reason is the price, starting at only $8,975, and with typical options less than $12,000. Another reason are the stylish lines, built to Chrysler's cab forward design concept. The interior is straightforward and friendly, with standard features we like, including dual airbags, a cup holder, an expandable sun visor, and idiot-proof ventilation controls. The clever packaging offers buyers more head and leg room than some mid-size cars. All but this base car have a folding rear seat, while the trunk offers a fine 11.8 cubic feet of space. The base Neon's 2-liter single overhead cam four-cylinder engine also outpowers all competitors with 132 horses. An even stronger dual cam version will arrive in the fall. But until then, our test car's 8.7 second zero to 60 time is more than adequate. We found the Neon's five-speed manual very accurate, but the automatic has only three speeds with no overdrive. The four-wheel fully independent suspension gives Neon a delightfully tossable nature. Brand new brakes, however, gave us a longish average stopping distance of 136 feet from 60. Anti-lock is available. EPA fuel mileage ratings are 29 city and 38 highway, and we average 33 miles per gallon. And predict a long and successful career for America's newest small car. But then the Neon is not America's first small car success of the 90s. That title goes to General Motors' Saturn. With its plastic body panels and innovative approaches to manufacturing and marketing, Saturn quickly carved out a solid market for itself. As with the Neon, pricing is a big part of this success. The Saturn sedan line starts at $9,995, and with air conditioning and other obvious options, still costs less than $12,000. Inside, the dash design is angular yet efficient and includes a set of effective analog gauges, as well as controls like this thumb wheel for the fan speed that are brilliant in their simplicity. But thus far, only a driver's side airbag. The front passenger gets one this fall. Long-legged folks will want to sit up front. The Saturn otherwise offers good room for four adults. A 60-40 folding rear seat is standard on all models, as is 11.9 cubic feet of trunk space. Engine size is 1.9 liters from four cylinders and the base single cam engine. Horsepower is 85. If you want more, a dual cam version with 124 horses is available. We recommend the dual cam engine, which ran to 60 in only 8.5 seconds. Strong bottom end power made up for a slightly notchy manual shifter. The automatic is a four speed. Steering feel is a bit uneven, but overall handling is sharp. All disc anti-lock brakes are available, but our car's standard disc drum stopped it in an average distance of 124 feet with excellent feel. The EPA predicts fuel mileage to be 25 city and 34 highway. We averaged an excellent 36 miles per gallon. And an excellent value is how we describe GM's new age compact. Now, if your tastes run to something more international, Volkswagen's Jetta 3 might be right for you. Offering the conservative but handsome look of all German cars, the Jetta is Volkswagen's top-selling U.S. model. That's despite a base price of $13,750. Add a few options, and it quickly rises to over $15,000. But for that price, the buyer gets a better-than-small-car interior design, except for the passenger airbag that displaces the glove box. But thoughtful features like height-adjustable front seat belts, twin vanity mirrors, and optional one-touch down power windows all around are welcome. And the interior is easily up to the task of carrying four adults, but has the class's most complex seat folding procedures. Yet passengers could even ride in the huge 15-cubic-foot trunk. 
A compliant, very quiet ride is also typically German. The Jetta 3 isn't the most powerful car in its class, but its two-liter four-cylinder engine still puts out a smooth 115 horsepower. But at 2,647 pounds, it's also the slowest to 60, with a best run of 10.1 seconds. The light, accurate five-speed shifter showed the benefits of German design precision. The automatic is a four-speed. Our test Jetta was a bit looser than the last one we drove, but retained its quick turn-in and minimal front plow, while its optional anti-lock brake stopped in in a short, straight 115-foot average. Fuel mileage is EPA rated to be 23 city and 31 highway. Our above average average was 35 miles per gallon. Teutonic refinement and efficiency in a compact car. That's the Volkswagen Jetta 3. Japanese cars such as the Toyota Corolla are also well known for their refinement. And like the Volkswagen, the Corolla lives at the upper end of the compact cost scale. Prices start at $12,098 and can quickly jump to $15,000. But that hasn't deterred many thousands of loyal Toyota customers. They value performance, reliability, and a no-nonsense interior design with foolproof controls, cup holder, as well as the safety of standard dual airbags and height-adjustable seatbelts. There's enough room inside to seat four adults, though we could use a bit more rear headroom. But the 12.7 cubic foot trunk will swallow all of their luggage. The Corolla's power comes from either a 105 horsepower 1.6 liter 4 in the base cars or a larger 1.8 liter unit as found in our DX test car. It makes 115 horses. And coupled with a positive 5-speed manual gearbox, sprinted to 60 in 9 seconds flat. The 4-speed automatic is one of the smoothest around. But it's in handling where the Corolla really shine, with grip and refined feel that rival that of sportier models. Braking followed the class standard, however. Front disc and rear drum stopped the car from 60 in an average distance of 130 feet. While fuel mileage, which is EPA rated at 27 city and 34 highway, averaged a better 38 miles per gallon. And average is hardly how we'd describe the Toyota Corolla. While it may be one of the oldest designs in our test, the Honda Civic sedan is also one of the most popular. You can get in one for $11,750, though dealer installed air conditioning can add up to $1,000 more. The interior is pure Honda, clean and uncluttered though the cup holder is one of the most complicated ones that we've ever seen. Standard features include dual airbags and height-adjustable seatbelt anchors, as well as an excellent layout of dash controls. Despite its subcompact status, there's plenty of interior room, whether you're seating four adults or folding the one-piece rear seat back down for access to the generous 12.4 cubic foot trunk. The Civic moves its cargo with a free-revving 1.6-liter four-cylinder engine. Base models make 102 horsepower, while our top EX grade test car makes 125. Its five-speed manual is one of the most positive shifters in the class and allowed it to sprint to 60 in only 9.1 seconds. A four-speed automatic is available. The well-balanced double wishbone suspension made it very nimble in corners. Anti-lock brakes are available on EX grade cars only and stopped our test car in a good average distance of 120 feet from 60. The EPA predicts that each gallon of fuel will last 29 miles in the city and 35 on the highway. We average 30 miles per gallon. So the Civic is a superb little car that deserves its excellent reputation. And there you have it, five of the best examples of the small family sedan class. From the sophisticated Volkswagen Jetta 3 to the ever popular Honda Civic, to the highly refined Toyota Corolla, to the trend-setting Saturn, to the roomy value price Dodge and Plymouth Neon. No better small sedans have ever been available to the family car buyer. And one of them is surely right for you.